Flight Serenity here, and welcome to part two of my military chess quest, where you open 303 chess with me. So let's jump right in. As you see, I have 303 chess, so let's get to open them. This is going to take a while, obviously. So I did make chapters. If you want to skip ahead to where I am uh, upgrading the gear, feel free to. Now, the chests contain materials to evolve and upgrade your battle gear, which consists of a weapon and or your weapon and a cloak. Now, the weapon function, um, you can't actually see that, but it increases your damage. Um, the cloak function gives you ethereal form, and it says that it lets you phase through bullets and aliens. I don't know if that means like totally invincible. There's still things that learning throughout this uh, journey on the military chess quest. So if you have any additional information, please feel free to leave it in the comments below. It's uh, very difficult to find out certain things. I still don't know if um, when you're upgrading, if you need to save all of your chess because it uses up um, the upgrade, or if it just, um, the charge, if it uses up your charge. I think I just hit the buy button. <laughs> um, no, I didn't. So I still don't know if when you're upgrading, if it uses up your charge, uh, the materials, or if the charge is only um, uses your gold. So that would be nice to find out if anybody knows the answer to that. All right, so the ethereal form, let's talk about that. The potentially invincible, but making you be able to phase through bullets and aliens. Um, it only lasts for a certain amount of time and based on your level, your gear level, will determine how long it lasts. Uh, and that is the cloak function, which we will get to and I will upgrade in just a little bit. So the maximum duration for that function for the cloak is 7.9 seconds, which that's actually a lot if you consider the Magic Pilot Squad gives you invincibility for 10 seconds, and that's only on the bosses. So if you think about it, 7.9 seconds of duration for, in essence, invincibility that lasts all throughout the match is almost as good as that Pilot Squad, but only lasting on the, uh, on the bosses. So let's open these last three right here, and we will get to upgrade. Now, my Thunderblade Cloak is already rare, so I am going to use that when we play the Daily Challenge, and I show you a few new things in the Daily Challenge. So let's go ahead and go to Upgrade and start upgrading the gear. See what we got. You have a charge right there. Is it using materials or not? Guess I could actually look, couldn't I? <laughs> so you notice how the left side is blue as you're going through. You can see that um, epic changes color, or I'm sorry, the rare changes color. Well, let's see what we have here. Okay, I don't know if I'm going to be able to get all of that, and it's an upgrade anyway, so. I will have to do that when I have time to write all that down. I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember all that. And that will actually possibly help me know if the uh, charging it uses actual materials. All right, 12, 12, and 1. I remember that. Charged. Oh, it does use materials. Dang! See, now that is why I waited um, to have so many chests and open them all at once. That does. Ooh, look and evolve. 
rare. Wow. There's a lot of people update um, these every time they get chess, which that's, I wonder how much uh, parts materials that actually uses to do that. That is a lot. So this new daily challenge is going to take a very long time, decades possibly. All right, let's look at my Thunderblade because that's the ship I'm going to use when I uh, play through the daily challenge with you. So the weapon, you can't really see, so we're not really concerned about that. The cloak, so, so far up at the top, it says my duration is 3.85 seconds. So, and I guess um, we'll see whenever I'm playing me shift into the ethereal form and you can actually see how long that lasts because I have been playing through the new content. Thank you, ABI, by the way. And I've actually gotten all the way through level 200 in the gatekeeper. So I love the new content. But having the ethereal form has really, really helped. And especially if you use it, whoops, especially if you use that ethereal form and like you plan for it and wait to get the last power up, um, those power ups give you the ethereal form. There's a little shield. You'll see what I'm playing. There's a little shield up the top left hand corner. And each time you get a power up, it actually charges that shield. It gives a little bit more. So when you, once you get the shield bar totally full, then you go into ethereal form. So you'll be able to see that as well. I was wondering with all of the upgrades, how much it would have helped me more in the, uh, new content but i was like no no i can wait for my military chess quest that's funny so if you look at the maximum duration let's look at this real quick so the most time you can get for the ethereal form is 7.9 seconds that is a lot when you consider the magic pilot squad and i already said that but that is actually a lot. Granted, it's immortal, so it's <laughs> going to take a really long time. Can I do that? Yeah, I just did that. All right, I'm almost done here. That's crazy to know that the charges um, take parts now. That's very helpful to know that the charges take parts now. Wow. Let's see. Epic on both of those. I love when it evolves, obviously. <laughs> I do wonder how long it's going to take to get to the uh, just the next level because I don't have those parts uh, mainly that we need. So I do wonder how long it will take. And I guess th now that we know the charges take actual parts, then that's what will happen with the common parts is they will be continued to be used during the uh, during the charging portion. Man, that's crazy. All right. That is a lot of parts just going away. Hey, little Cyberblade. All right, Drake. Almost done here. All right, so that's where we are at. Let me take a little run through here and see how much epic. I thought I just did that, and yet it's still like that, but that's all right. So we've got epic on so far, most of that, which is great. And then the cloak, let me look at that again so I can actually pay attention this time. The cloak is 3.8 seconds and almost to the next level. So, all right. Let's talk about the setup. 
um, before we actually start because we're going to go through uh, one of the daily modes, one of the daily challenges. Oops, wrong button. And need to talk about the setup first. There is a few things that I figured out in the daily challenge that I was like, oh my gosh. <laughs> so we're going to talk about that too. Okay. We're going to start with the golden wings and then we're going to use power squad and let's look at our EIs real quick. We're starting in the middle planet. So we want to start with Thunderblade. So we're going to equip the carrier uplink. And then this is what I figured out that I should have been doing all along. I cannot believe I haven't been doing it, but power converter. So every crappy ship you get, you still get a power up. And then legendary is the last thing. Hopefully we'll be on legendary longer. So let's actually look at the cloak on legendary instead of Thunderblade. And the duration is four seconds. So that's great. And let's jump in. Now the new um, content that they have put in as far as challenges, it is very long term until you see those rewards and a lot of work to get the um to get the resources needed so in in this daily challenge i can see how a beginner player that is not as geared up whoops shouldn't have done that how a beginner player would have a much much longer time i am not going to get that super because i want to get it on the legendary, so I'm gonna wait for that. But a, an intermediate or minor league player that is not as geared, I mean, it would just take forever to get anywhere near this. So once again, not gonna get that. I should be getting the legendary right here. And then it should proc our golden wings, which there they are. It just gives me one more uh, life. So I'm actually excited to see this. Whoops, did not mean to do that. Okay, the cloaking, we need a few more power-ups and we'll get that cloak. Really excited to see what four seconds looks like. <laughs> hmm. All right, there we go, ethereal form. Wow, that seemed to last a while. In four seconds, that's a little over halfway. So I think the longest is, was it 7.9? So that was decent. It seemed like a while. I also thought about something else. When you're in the higher up levels, in the higher up gear levels for the cloak and the weapon, every time you upgrade, are you going to be needing the common materials other than to charge it? So in essence, are you going to end up with an abundance of common materials uh, just because you need it to charge? So that is a thought. One more thing that I'm not quite sure. Okay, I need to go ahead and kill myself. And that will show you. I must have lost my golden wing somewhere. That will show you what we're about to do. So we're on four or five. And... Once this dies, you're going to go ahead and kill yourself. There you go. Three chests. So I hope you like this video. And please seriously contemplate liking and subscribing. And thank you for taking this journey with me.